Hey guys, I'm in my game room. This is my favorite part of the game room because this is where I keep my Atari 2600 homebrew games. Now this is my favorite shelf in that section because this is where I keep my champ game homebrew games. And I love playing these games. I play them all the time. But the problem is that there's one game that I can't play with a regular Atari 2600 controller. And that's Robot War 2684. You just can't do it because you can't move in one direction and shoot in another. You just can't do it with a regular CX40 controller. So... I was at the Korg's Gaming Convention in Columbus, Ohio last year, and my buddy Brian from BD Retro Mods suggested that I get this. Now, this is a great controller. This works great with this game, but it's also compatible with um, the home port of Robotron 2084 for your Atari 7800 or your 8-bit computer. So we're going to try this out on all three systems and see how it works. So stay tuned. Let's get to it. This controller comes with either a ball top or bat top control sticks in a variety of colors. I prefer the bat top control sticks. They just feel better in my hands. This is not a handheld controller, although you might be able to play it that way. The controller has rubber feet, which keep it from sliding around when playing. I use a TV cart to set it on, and it works just fine for me. There are two controller cables, one for each control stick and two fire buttons. For demonstration purposes, I'm just showing you how you can move in one direction with the left joystick and fire with the right. This is Robot War 2684 by Champ Games for the Atari 2600, which is my favorite port of Robotron 2084. I've seen adapters that people have made to put two CX-40 controllers together and play that way, but I would think that that would be bulky. I would also think that the sticks would be awkward to move in this type of game. So this is the Atari 7800 version of Robotron 2084. Same concept, you move in one direction with the left joystick and fire with the right. And finally, this is the Atari 8-bit version of Robotron 2084, and the controls work just the same. I know that there are other options for controls out there, but this is an amazing controller. If you'd like to get one of these, I've left links in the description of the video to the BD Retro Mods website and to their Facebook page. Just be sure that if you go, tell Brian that Retro Bliss sent you. Well, that wraps it up for my review of the Atari Dual Stick Controller by BD Retromods. 
While you're here, be sure to subscribe to the channel and turn on your notifications for more gaming reviews and videos. So with that, have an awesome day, and we'll see you on the next one.